We're joined now by our analysts, Mark Hardy, Jamie Storr, former Kings. Gentlemen, as always, welcome. Let's begin with this. The Kings have had three seven-game series. Some would suggest they might be fatigued mentally and exhausted physically. How much of a factor, and Mark, I'll start with you, do you think this will play into the series? Well, I don't think it's going to play a factor at all in this series. I think when you're playing for that Stanley Cup, mentally, your, your mental being takes over, and it's something that we've grown up with trying to win from when we were little kids. And, you know, they have some veteran players that have been there before. And I know that they won't let the young kids feel fatigue or anything. They're going to have that leadership from within the room. Jamie, what do you think? Well, you know what? When you look at the fatigue factor, the fatigue factor starts to play in more set um, when it comes to injuries. You start to look at, you see the last game, game seven, uh, Dowdy starting to wince a little bit every time he gets hit. You see Carter went into the boards once and struggled getting up. And, you know, I think. Uh, the mindset of when fatigue sets in, uh, they start making a little bit more mental mistakes, but I'm more concerned of uh, the fact that they played 40, 42 days, 21 games. Right. You know, just making sure that they can stay healthy through this series. All right, let's talk about the goaltender because that'll be a key. Henrik Lundqvist of the Rangers has been a stone wall. Jonathan Quick has played well, not as well as Lundqvist. Let's break down the goalies. Jamie, you start. Well, when you take a look, you got two of the best goalies playing, uh, you know, in the finals, which is what you want. You know, you went from 30 teams down to two. Um, it, it's it's uh, two of the best goalies that you'd pick right now playing head to head against each other. The only difference I look at is, uh, you know, Quick is is on a, a team that's a little bit more favored. Uh, you know, you, you look at two guys uh, driving identical cars, but the one engine's just a little bit stronger, a little bit faster. So Quick doesn't have to be as good in my mind uh, to win this series. He just has to be good. Where I think for the New York Rangers to have a chance, uh, Henrik Lundqvist has to stand on his head and, and steal games. All right, we are getting short on time because I told you we had a lot of time, but see, then I told you that you guys wouldn't stop talking. So here's the bottom line. As we get ready to go, who wins and how many games? Mark, go ahead. Well, I picked the Kings, and I think it's going to be a long series. It's going to go at least six or seven games. Jamie. Well, you know what? I, I think that since every game's gone to seven, and, uh, you know, you take a look at the series length, is, uh, in my mind, going to be seven games, and uh, it'll be an L.A. win again. All right, we've got 40 seconds. The X factor in this series. What will be the difference? Mark. Well, I, I'm going to go because I coached him, uh, Drew Doughty. I think Drew Doughty is going to be the X factor there. The way that he carries the puck out of his own end, he's going to be in every tight situation on the ice. Power play, penalty killing, when they're down a goal with the last minute, when they're up a goal with the last minute, he's the guy that's going to be on the ice, and I think he's going to be the X factor in my eyes. In 10 seconds, Jamie, who? Well, we'll go with Henrik Lundqvist. Uh, I think, you know, for, for the Rangers to be successful in this series, Henrik Lundqvist has to steal games, and, you know, we'll, we'll see how he does tonight. We will indeed. Mark and Jamie will be along, as will I, after the game with a post-game report. Mario Solis will be in the Kings locker room. We'll let you hear what the players have to say. We're set for hockey on Channel 4. Stanley Cup Final, Game 1. Kings and Rangers, sit back, enjoy the game, and we'll see you immediately after. Go Kings, go!